The village is under attack! West Harbor is under attack! You're safe! Grab a weapon. We need to help defend the village. How would I know? There's nothing in this village of value. Maybe they're just raiding for food. Not that it matters. We are under attack, and we need to help defend the village. We'd better hurry. I saw some of them following us on our way here. They're likely to hit this house next. Don't be crazy. You know our village is the only settlement in this swamp. Where else would we go? It's in that chest, next to your bed. You keep everything in there, remember? Hurry up and arm yourself. The longer we wait, the more we put the village at risk. Yes, indeed. What? What is it? Kofim Safik.
There you are. I saw some of those creatures enter your house, and it is good to see you safe. I don't know where these beasts came from, but we need every sword at the Southern Bridge. More of these creatures are on the way, and in greater numbers. Georg is trying to gather the militia, but I fear he would not be able to marshal the defense in time and without help. This village will fall. Head south along the road. I will stay here and look for the wounded, then join you. Georg should be at the bridge. Join him quickly. He will no doubt have orders for you. But before you go, take this blessing from Lathander, all of you. If you are wounded or need another blessing in the fight ahead, simply return and speak to me. I say! Thank the gods you made it. There's been no sign of your father, and I feared you'd been killed as well. I have no idea where these creatures came from or what they want, but the ones loose in the village are only the first wave. More are coming. A lot more. If we're going to stop them, we need someone to rally the militia and meet them head on. I can't leave the southern half of the village exposed. Not while more attackers keep pouring in. Now go. When you've gathered everyone you can, meet me at the wheat field south and west of here. We'd better search the town, try to gather who we can, and I hope we can find enough still alive.
What is it? Huh? Get away! Didn't you see those creatures out there? The, what, you came to drag me out there to die? Not on your life. I'm staying right here. I'm not going. The village is dead anyway. I'm not joining the corpses. What are you doing? Stop! Please don't have... <laughs> Team Safik. Three, stay out of this. It's too dangerous. Master, just hold on. We can help. So the world seeks to test herself. How pathetic. Blast it! The rest of you, stay where you are! I shall waste no more time on this pitiful village. It is not here. In the Yekoro. Let's go! Get on them! Attack, I say! The stupid girl! I told her to stay out of it! There's more to do. Georg and the militia are holding our attackers at bay on the Starling Farm. We must hurry before the tide turns. Leave her. It's too late. We must hurry to the Starling Farm before more harbormen meet the same fate as she did. The girl is dead. Now move, before we lose even more to this attack. I want to help her too, but Tarmas is right. Amy didn't have a chance. Let's head for my family's farm. Georg will need every harp. I do not know, but he was clearly skilled in the art. He probably led the attack on West Harbor. We must hurry to the Starling Farm before more harbormen meet the same fate as my apprentice. If only I had more time to gather equipment from my home. If you make your way there, you may find some magical and alchemical equipment of use. It's to the north. Now go! What's up? Sure, yes.
We need to gather more of the militia, and I think you're the only one who can do it. Get in step. Follow me. Sure, yes. Let's see what you We don't have enough militia to stop them. See who else would look for the wo- Well done! Now we have a chance! All right, militia! Ready your weapons and move out! It's time we stand our ground! This spot, this spot right here. Hey, 
Crouch in step. Follow me. Get on them! Attack, I say! More of them? Regroup! Cyric's blood, they're entering the Starling House. But if we don't hold the next wave off, the whole village could be overrun. Let's go. If we hurry, we can stop them before they find the children. We could use every sword, but the children... You do what you think is right. I'm going in before anything happens to my brother and sister. Brace yourselves, men! Thank the gods that's over. We would not have held them much longer. Dagon! Much blood has been lost tonight. Let us make the enemy pay in kind. That is the last of them. For now, gather the wounded and the dying. Let's see how many we can steal from death's clutches. Thank the gods we were able to hold them at the farm. How many did we lose? Ian! Vera! Pearson! What were those things anyhow? I mean... Those dwarves look similar to Dagon's ward, but... And those creatures that attacked with the dwarves. I've never seen their like before. They're called bladelings. Their kind is rarely seen in our realm. They dwell in a place beyond. Well then, what in the nine hells are they doing here? Lathander doesn't illuminate all mysteries for me. We must rely on our own wit and resources. One of those dwarves mentioned they were searching for something. Does anybody know what it was? Boy... Come over here. I see you're unharmed. Many have not been so fortunate, and others have seen their final night. I understand you lost a friend of yours in the attack. A tragedy. She was a promising young mage. Or so I've been told. That you will. I see you understand the folly of dwelling upon loss. I do not have much time to talk. There are many who are wounded. Now, there is something you must do tonight. Those bladelings were here to find something, and I fear I know what. Very good. This is not a night for words, but action. 
There is an item, a silver shard. Long ago, I concealed it in the old stones outside of town. I fear it may have drawn these creatures down upon us. Think it through. Their kind doesn't plunder a village like West Harbor. Not for a few coins and an old helm or two. They had a reason. It is from the time when your mother died. Those were dark times for the village. We can speak more of the shard after you've returned. For now, all that matters is its retrieval. The stones outside of town are older and deeper than you may think. In the farthest chamber of these ruins, look for a strong box. Inside is the shard. There remains only one thing. You should not go alone. Bevel, I need you to accompany my son to the ruins. This is an important task. But Georg says the ruins have been overrun by lizardling tribes. And that is why you must go. Together, two can succeed where one might fail. The cries of the wounded cannot be ignored any longer. Find the shard. Find it and bring it here. No offense meant, but your father makes the hairs on my neck stand up. Still, if we're going to do this, we should make some haste. It sounds urgent. Yes, thank the gods. I arrived before they had found the children. Fortunately, they were too busy ransacking the house to notice me. Gave me the advantage. So, um, shouldn't we get moving? Your father made it sound urgent that we start. This path that runs along the river is our best route into the swamp. I hope these ruins aren't too hard to find. We could be out there all night. It's been an age since I've come this far into the swamp. There are some twists and turns before we get to the ruins. There's probably more than lizardlings ahead. So, uh, lead on, I guess.